Hi everyone, my name is Kofi Buziachi. I'm with the Young Investors Network and I'm here to present to you the Stock Pitch Competition. You know, the Stock Pitch Competition is a new program. It's the first of its kind to happen in this country. And the Young Investors Network is partnering with the Ghana Stock Exchange uh, to present to you, to bring the stock market to the doorstep of all the students within the country. Currently, we are being partnered by also the Securities and Exchange Commission, UMB Stockbrokers, and CTFM and CTTV, meaning that CTFM are prepared to give us a platform, all right, so that um, we will talk about the program, and also when we get the winners, they'll have a platform to also speak. Okay, these are all opportunities for you to market yourself. Okay, so uh, I really want to implore upon you, upon everybody who has seen this advert, to partake in it okay um i've received some few calls from some of you uh, regarding how the program is about or what really it is despite the many narratives that are out there we know it's quite uh, technical it's quite unique so um we need to explain to you to explain to you what it is when you talk about stock pitch basically what we are expecting from you is to pick a company one company that is listed on the Ghana Stock Exchange, okay, do a comprehensive analysis on the company. I've had some calls also from some accounting students. I know you guys are already familiar with the financial statements and all that, but when it comes to analyzing the information or doing financial analysis on the data, it's a bit problematic. We are here to help you. We are, that's what we are here to do, all right? So basically, financial statements are divided into three parts. All right, basically, so the balance sheets, the income statement, the cash flow statement. These are your, your, your the sets of the financial statements. So what you have to do is to pick, do a three-year analysis minimum. You can do a five-year, okay, but you can do a three-year analysis for the past record. So currently, we are in the world. The current data you can get is the third quarter 2020. Okay, when you go to financial statements or annual reports ghana.com you can get all the information regarding the reports we are talking about so when you pick ecobank ghana you visit annual reports dot annual reports ghana.com okay you can get the financial statements uh, uh, for the period you are looking for when you pick the balance sheet for instance do a past record analysis pick the data the end values within the the balance sheets record it do a graph presentation okay do also a projection of the figures these are all tricks that will help you in your presentation okay so that um you won't just be picking current data uh, to do your present. current data is not enough to present to your investors you know with the investors this is what, this is what we do this is what we do in the in in our markets in the financial sector we pick the data we do analysis we do projections and we present to them it has to be convincing enough so the work or the studies that you are having on your campuses it is the same thing that we are applying okay when you come to the job market we apply some certain techniques to them okay but the basics is what you people are doing in school. Do not shy away from them, okay? I want to beg all of you to ensure that you go by the principles that you have learned in school. It is no different. It is not very different from what you do. So in taking up this opportunity to do the present, this presentation, the next thing that you should expect from us is that we will guide you. We will guide you because it is because of the job market that you are in school. Okay, it's because of the job market. Some of you will be um, entrepreneurs and you need to understand this kind of skill in order to, in order to thrive within whichever sector you find yourself. Okay, so when you pick your balance sheet, you do your three-year analysis of all the three sectors. So you have the assets, liabilities, you have the shareholders' equity. So do a three-year analysis on the past event and do a three-year event on the future. Pick the, you know, the, the, equity, the equity position is normally the book value. 
okay so you have to ensure that you get those information right do your projection okay then you can also go to your income statements income statement look at your revenue look at the bottom line okay look at the factors that are causing them differentials within the trend so if at a point in time the company makes a loss look within the report and find out what is causing the loss of this company report on it and the judges will be convinced or investors will be convinced by the information you are given okay the cash flow statement pick the items within them the bottom is the cash and cash equivalent report on it why is the company not making or not having enough cash give enough information okay let us know that you understand what you are doing then you can make your presentation after all this uh, you go to the industry do an industry analysis too you find out whether the company is performing below or above average within the company sorry uh, within the industry okay so um, with this information when you give them to investors they will know that you are doing the right thing you know what you are about okay and the next thing is also pick some information within the economy so you can relate inflation depreciation rates interest rates all these factors related to what is happening within the economy or within the stock market so um you can say that maybe high interest rate normally high interest rates okay they affect the performance of stock markets so if interest rates are high basically or fundamentally stock prices go down you give reasons why this is so okay if you have any questions you can call us between myself and joshua mensa the numbers that will be running at the bottom of the screen or if you visit our website you can pick any of the numbers and also call us okay so um i, I think you guys need, need to push yourself okay don't be don't be don't be set about you have to be bold okay it's the same thing you have done in school it's the same thing you are studying hmm? Call us anytime. Call us anytime. We want to help you. The stock market, we realize we as young investors, and we know we've been going over all over the campuses. We've been across a lot of campuses, UPSC, Central University, University of Ghana, Pentecost University, and so on. All the universities, we've been going to ma many of the campuses, UCC, KNUST. What we have realized is that most students do not understand what is happening in the stock market. Finance students, when we hear this from them, it, it breaks our hearts because we, from us, we know that this is what you are studying in school. This is what you are studying in school. So why is, why, why the separation? And practicalize what you are studying. Practicalize it so that you would, you would be able to fit into the industry, the, the, the financial system uh, easily. Okay, so um, the stock market, there are about 37 companies that are listed. All these companies, when you are doing an analysis, pick one of them. Any of them that has, been, that has seen some activities in the last 12 months. Okay, do not pick a company that has not been active on the market. Okay, the banking stocks are very active, including uh, 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 the others in the oil and the... So Unilever, for instance, okay? You can pick it, you know, Lever, Total, Goyal, and so on. All these companies are companies that have seen some activities, a lot of activities within the last 12 months. Okay, pick any of them. Sit down quietly with your team member. If you cannot find a team member, you can do it alone. Okay, all you have to do is that pick your phone and call us. We will guide you. Okay, sit down, pick the, the, the financial reports or the financial statements. Go through it item by item. Pick the ratios. The ratios too is not something that is new to you. Okay, uh, liquidity ratios, shareholder ratios, and so on. Okay, current ratio, asset test. Uh, you pick any of them. All right. We all we know is that in the asset test ratio, when a company records a figure lower than one, uh, it means the company is is in some time of some kind of a, a, a liquidity problem okay current ratio it should range between uh, 1.5 to 2.5 okay you have to understand these techniques one area you can also look at 
uh, one website you can visit to get all this information or the information regarding um, this financial statement analysis for easy understanding okay when you visit investopedia.com all this information is there pick them take your time visit the website pick if you don't understand financial this is also for non-finance people okay non-finance people can also partake in it so you pick this item what is financial statement put it in there the meaning comes out what is balance sheet the meaning comes out what are the processes of getting the value of a company the 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 details comes out we would want you to have time okay have time and go through this we want to groom you to be very good investors in yourself and in companies in the future and that is what we want our students or what we want our our people that want to impact okay so go to investopedia you can pick all those information level one by one and ensure that you understand Call us. I keep saying you have to call us. Okay. So um, if uh, I, I think I've, I've given much information about the stock pitch. All right. So you pick all this data. You go to the market. You pick the prices of the company. So Ecobangan in the last three years, how has it performed? You can pick month on month uh, price. You can also say year and year end prices. Okay. So do evaluation of the company. Again, if you don't know how to do an evaluation of the company, go to this Investopedia website I'm talking about. Okay, so pick valuation models. They are models that you can easily compute. We have the discounted cash flow. We have the balance sheet model. Pick all those models and try to work them out. When you come to the stage, we will guide you. Do you understand? Okay. So get the values of the company. Compare them to what is happening on the stock market. There could be a situation where the price you are recording per your calculation is higher or lower than what is happening on the stock market. So with that information, you can recommend either a buy, a sell, or a hold position. With this information, then the judges or the investors you are talking to who know that this guy is really making sense here okay so the, the prices are also you can when you visit the GSC website the Ghana Stock Exchange website gsc.com.gh when you visit the website you can get the prices of all the companies listed within the past period in fact if you go beyond up to like five years you can get the data as well so kindly visit the website get all the information that you need okay all right i think i've spoken enough about how the pitch is about so um basically we need you to do a 10 a 10 page slide okay your appendix and the table of contents should be part of the 10 pages your 10 pages you can have some graphical representation graphical representation okay um, let it help with your presentation. So it's just 10 minutes. 10 minutes per team or 10 minutes per person. Do your 10 minutes presentation. Then the judges will have time to also assess what we have done. Okay. Um, it's open to persons who are currently in school. This competition is open to every student in school. Every student should partake in this competition. All right take part of this competition if you have completed in the last five years so you are qualified okay so um the group members should be maximum three and one person can actually uh, take part in this competition i've mentioned the 10 10 uh, slides uh, and it should be in a powerpoint format it should be in a powerpoint format and the constraint is that stocks have to come from the companies that are listed on the stock market period we don't want you to go outside <clears throat> the stock market to pick any any company. We want to deal with the companies that are listed on the stock market. And um, the equities, I've mentioned this already, equities must have witnessed some activities in the last 12 months. It's a 10 minutes presentation as well. And this is some of the things that judges are going to look at. So the judges will evaluate your finding through the evaluation of the stock. They will also look at the quality of your presentation 
on your arguments for buying, selling, or holding the particular stocks. The overall flow and the communication of your presentation and the involvement of team members. Involvement of team members is also very crucial. Accuracy in answering questions too will be high on the judge's agenda. Okay. So in doing your stock pitch, you can consider the following. Research the industry. I've mentioned this already. Have a strong basis for your knowledge and understanding. Have a strong basis. Conduct a strong market analysis. Okay. Understand the environment and external factors which may influence your approach. Approach your pitch using various financial instruments. Have a strong financial knowledge of the company being pitched. These are things that we all do in school. Don't be afraid. There are a lot of accounting students, there are a lot of finance students, there are a lot of sociology students who are very smart. A lot of economic students. It, this is open for, to all students. I mentioned earlier, if you don't understand anything, in order to give yourself to the world, you could open yourself up. Pick the items one by one. Go into investopedia.com. Google them. Search for the information. Everything is available online. Okay, these are some of the things that you need. So ensure that you don't have, you do not get information overflow. Ensure you get the right information into the right document. Get your strong, the strongest points to do your presentation. All right, visuals. I mentioned about. I've mentioned visuals already. Visuals are highly recommended. Use it to your advantage. Please note that there will be a projector in the room during the presentation. All right, print copies. So um, each member of the group, if you are two, if you are three, each copy should hold a copy. Each each, each member should hold a copy of the document. Okay, while you do your presentation. And another three should be handed over to the judges, the printed copies. So in all, you are coming, you are coming with printed copies for your team members as well as copies for the judges. There will be three judges available, okay, who are experienced investment bankers, experienced investment bankers within the, the, the sector. Okay, so you will not lose out, okay, when you participate in this pitch. Okay, and um, the by 11th of November 2020, this year, which is about some few days away, not very few, but 11th of November 2020, your work should be complete. The document should be complete. Ensure that you send you send a copy to finance callers yen at gmail.com. F I N A N C E S C O L A R S Y I N at gmail.com. Send your work to this email. All right. On the day of the competition, this is what we we'll use for the projection. Okay. And remember that be extremely thorough, be informative, and it should be practical. Okay. 10 minutes is not a lot of time. So be very brief and present only your strongest arguments. Be very brief and present your strongest arguments. If you have any any more questions, any more questions, let us know. Okay, this uh, will be post, will be put on our YouTube channel. You can put the questions within the comment side. Okay, then we'll come and attend to you. You can leave your contact numbers too. I want everybody to be part of this competition. The registration ends on the 30th of October. If you want us to give you some space to participate, let us know. It depends on how you communicate to us. Okay. I thank you very much. God bless you. We wish you all the best from the Young Investors Network. Then again, the sponsors are the Ghana Stock Exchange, the Securities and Exchange Commission, UMB Stockbrokers. Uh, yes, I think basically these are the, the people who are involved. Okay. So SEC, UMB Stockbrokers, Ghana Stock Exchange. I think there's one more. All right. You, let's, let's leave it here. City FM, City TV. All right, CTFM and CTTV. So 
the winners will be given a platform to speak on their experience for the stock pitch competition. I wish you all the best. Bye-bye.